Willemse was popular amongst his council colleagues. It was the opposition who helped vote him in as mayor after Spies's ousting. But this did not sit well with the DA, who eventually removed him through a vote of no confidence. He's now looking to make changes in Eisner as an independent candidate. I can bring the people together so we can, we can focus on, on the key issues, um, which seems to be um, very relevant at the moment because the focus is, seems to be lost. You know, there's political parties, lots of infighting within the parties, um, and as an independent I can play a very important role, and people seem to be recognising that at the moment because service delivery is key. In George there are four wards up for grabs. The town has had its own share of political scandals, with former Mayor Malvin Nike facing corruption charges relating to a multi-million rand project. His axing led to a snowball effect, with other DA members resigning or being removed from the party. The party's new federal leader was in the region recently to campaign. We don't keep them in power like you see in Parliament and in President Ramaphosa's cabinet where the same people behind state capture, behind uh, you know, the Guptas, behind it, are still sitting in those key, uh, key positions. We remove the rotten apples from the DA. We don't keep them in because we know if you keep the rotten apples in a council or in a uh, legislature or in a parliament, they end up infecting the rest of the barrel. And that's how you end up with the huge amount of billions that have been looted from the South African taxpayers and residents of this country. The ANC will only be contesting in George. They are hoping to make inroads in this DA stronghold. In fact, our goal is to make sure that we work towards 2021. This will just be a stepping stone for us, ensuring that uh, people come and vote and we have spoken to people and we had a good, uh, uh, we've been, we have been received very well. Uh, when we were doing door-to-door -door canvassing people and people were telling us that they were looking forward to give the ANC an opportunity because all the awards have never been ANC awards before. Smaller parties such as the Plaaslijke Besorgde Inwoners have become more popular in recent elections. The battle is for the heart and soul of George. This is after the DA has fired some of their councillors that uh, differed uh, from their party positions in council. The PBI is a front runner at the moment uh, we are making huge inroads and strides and the communities are asking us uh, to position ourselves to bring some change, much needed change for them and therefore we are asking each and every person in those wards to vote for us. Other parties that will contest the by-elections in George include the EFF, FF+, African Progressive Movement, Al Jamaa and the Good Party. And in Naisna, the EFF, FF+, and Naisna Independent Movement will also be hoping for more votes. Tanya Krauser, SABC News, George in the Southern Cape.